Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna show you some outfits for my travel capsule wardrobe. Now that I'm a digital nomad, I really had to think about what items of clothing I'm gonna bring so that my luggage isn't heavy, it's not difficult for me to bring around, but I can mix and match and still look Lux. I want to be stylish, I want to be comfortable, so those are kind of like the list of non-negotiables that I have when it comes to my clothes. You'll see that I'm going to be wearing a lot of comfortable things, but I still want to look like a Lux traveling CEO, a Lux digital nomad. Okay, let's dive in. So I've unpacked and laid out the clothes that Christine packed for my travel capsule because she's just the best person ever, basically. And one of the things that she actually recommended I buy was this boiler suit from Shona Joy. This is my second boiler suit. And guys, I'm just gonna be the boiler suit girl, basically. But I've also have here some of my basic tops and I did pack my cream pants as well. They are my alternative to my jeans. So if you see the texture between the two, they're two different types of cloth and material. One of the things that I was working on with Christine is to transition out of my jeans because I was feeling really safe in my jeans and we needed to figure out a way where you know, I feel more comfortable to choose something else that's not jeans if it's, you know, something a bit more casual. And this was just the perfect one. I believe it is from Petal and Pup. Yep, it is from Petal and Pup. Again, you can tell the difference between the two. And so this is more for my casual wear. And this is a little bit more dressy. But again, I love both of them. So I'm gonna show you what these look like. I always bring this top. This is a top from Kukai. It's a razor back top, I think, I believe. I hope that's right. But I love this because this year my color is green according to my Chinese birth chart reader. And this top just makes me look sexy and fit and just it gives me so much confidence. The rest are basics as you can see. A lot of these are from Decuba actually. So we have our Decuba basics. So this jacket, Christine basically told me that I have this puffy black jacket. She's like, this could replace that. And this will work during the winter and during autumn as well. Cause the puffy jacket that I have, it's a particular type of style. And Christine tells me that she doesn't think it's the style that I want. And I actually really agree. So a few more basics. And she actually got me to also get this, which is another Decuba piece. And so I'm gonna try all of these guys together and see what I can come up with in terms of outfits. I wanna keep my travel capsule lean. And this travel capsule right here, this is mostly for when I'm traveling between Brisbane or Sydney or Melbourne. My Bali trip is a different story because I wanna add a few more pieces into that. Although this will also be in my Bali travel capsule wardrobe essentials. So my style that I'm going for is Lux comfy for traveling CEO type. So yeah. Okay, this is the first outfit I am not wearing any shoes but these are the more casual pants cream pants that i'm gonna be using in lieu of my denim jeans this shirt is from the cuba i tucked it in the front i'm not sure if that's great but you know what this is gonna be my casual wear mm. no shoes because i'm inside the house asian mm. 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 so this one i'm gonna show you the Decuba jacket that Christine got me because I think this is going to instantly elevate this casual outfit. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What up, what up? I do like it. I do like it. I do like it. <laughs> and I know I said no slippers, but I wanted to see if it looks good. I mean, obviously I wouldn't wear this to work to work meeting, maybe it will. Maybe it will. Yeah, why not? Hello. <laughs> All right, next outfit. I've actually worn the same, same pair of pants and I've worn my sneakers, my black, all black sneakers. They're from Nike and I changed my top into this white Kokai sleeveless top. And I do love this top, but sometimes I feel a bit bloated and I feel like my flats are coming out like this, especially when I don't stand up straight. So what I've done is I just kind of untucked it a bit, give this perception that my flabs is the untucked. <clears throat> the 
this is what it looks like. And what I'm gonna do to zhuzh it up a little bit is I'm gonna take that same Decuba jacket and put it on. And instantly, lux, but comfy. Lux, but comfy. Actually, I really love this outfit. Thank you, Christine, for the wonderful style tips. All right, guys, that wasn't so lux of me, but here it is. Okay, next outfit. And as you can tell, the more I start changing my outfits, the more my hair is getting loose. So this is the green top that I mentioned earlier, but I absolutely love the fit on me. I love the color, green is my color this year. I'm wearing it again with the more casual cream pants, wide leg pants. I'm also wearing my Tony Banco slides, which I basically use for everything. When I walk a polo sometimes, when I go to the grocery, this is the next outfit. So I've changed my pants to the dressier pants, dressier quality, and I've worn the black top from the Deluxe line of Decuba. I've kept my all black sneakers on, and to dress it up a little bit more, I actually wore some hoop earrings, and I'm also wearing my all black sunnies. I actually really love this outfit. This is like so chill. It's so comfortable, I feel so comfy. And what I've done is I've actually just tucked in the front part here, tucked it in. And I love these pants because I usually have this pouch, but it just covers it and it makes me look luxe and hot and I can move. Ah, ah, really love it. This travel capsule is so dope. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna see if I can dress this up a bit more with the Decuba jacket. So let's try it on. Ooh, yes, I love it. I actually really love this. I think I might need like a statement necklace. Otherwise, I love it. This is actually so comfortable. Like I would wear this every day at home while I work from home. <laughs> okay, so. Now I'm wearing the Decuba hoodie from the Deluxe line. Oh, hello. We have a friend. Apollo is out in daycare. So this is Sarah and Sarah's out to play. That's nice. That's nice. Hold the hand a little bit more. I kind of like it like that. Like just, you know, loose. Like what up? Like what up? Hey, Sarah. Hello, darling. <laughs> she loves it. She likes it. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, guys, I just opened my Shona Joy boiler suit that Christine recommended I buy. And I'm wearing my Tony Banco slides. And whoa, this is like next level comfortable luxe. So, again, I'm gonna do the trick that Christine taught me how to do, which is to roll up my sleeves and fluff it out. The fit is great. I got the size eight. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. I can literally wear this everywhere. I will wear this to the groceries, to a meeting, picking up my nieces, walking a polo. This is literally my everyday suit. This is the ultimate digital nomad capsule item. What do you think, Sarah? She loves it. Guys, this is amazing. This is actually so amazing. <gasps> Just look at that. I love it. I actually truly love this. It's like, this is, this is so good. Okay, so those were some of the outfits that I have in my travel capsule wardrobe. If you're thinking about being a digital nomad or you're traveling a lot this year and you're wanting to be stylish and luxe, but at the same time feel comfortable, I hope this video has been able to help you. If you want to know more about capsule wardrobes or how to be stylish or how to go from having nothing to wear to always having something to wear, my business bestie and my real life bestie Christine Fernandez and I have online courses or style education programs, workshops, masterclasses that you can purchase right here, right now. So I have a special promo for you guys for watching this video and getting to 
this part of the video. If you want to learn more about being stylish and being a digital nomad, stay tuned, follow for more, and I will see you in the next video. Oh, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Ciao!